I'm Allie Lynch at the WKRN.com alert desk. This morning, officials just wrapped up a news conference in Baltimore following the bridge collapse. The U.S. Coast Guard saying they are continuing to look for any survivors. So far, they pulled two people from the river. One is said to be in serious condition. So just a horrifying scene this morning. The Francis Scott Key Bridge struck by a cargo ship and collapsing around 1.30 a.m. Right now, that search continues for at least seven people after several vehicles fell into the chilly waters. Dramatic video shows the moment the bridge appears to snap and then tumble into the river after the vessel collides with one of its supporting structures. The Coast Guard's primary mission right now is search and rescue, looking for any survivors in the water. On scene, we currently have three small boats. We also have Coast Guard Cutter Mako, an 87-foot patrol boat. We have a helicopter from Air Station Atlantic City, and we're working with numerous federal, state, and local partners on scene on these search and rescue efforts. So officials say there were workers on the bridge at the time of its collapse. Police also tell us there was no evidence that the ship collision into the bridge was intentional. And of course, for breaking news around the clock, you can go to WKRN.com.